everyone welcome back to seven daily beauties it's friday original it's friday it's let me see what time it is 9 48 so i'm a bit late i'm uploading because i haven't had the time to record i've been busy trying to fix my the car my dark car from me and my me and my husband's car something wrong with the brakes and then let me say i got sick on tuesday it wasn't Tuesday. I don't know when was it. It was a Monday. Monday, I believe. What was it? I believe it was Monday or Sunday. I don't remember. One of those days. We had like a huge blizzard. And then we... On the next day, um, we... um, It was really sunny. The whole sun melted. The, the snow, most of the snow. Then the next day, it was raining. Then the following day... Um, it was, there's a lot of wind going on right now, so it's kind of weird, especially because we live in the windy city, and it's Chicago, and so on, so it's unexpected, this weather. So, because of those dramatic changes of the weather, I got sick, as you can tell. So, I just put on my, somewhat on my eyebrows, I didn't even, like, I just put the powder, so they're not shaved, they're not clean, they're just, like, whatever. I was just, like, I was, like, weird, so. And I just did, like, a simple, um... Uh, what's it called? Um, neutral eye. Just so I can look somewhat good. I don't have no foundation to conceal anything. Just my eyes, my eyebrows. And yeah, so I just got out of the shower. I just blow dry my hair. Because yeah, cause I was feeling crappy. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to take a shower. Because most of the time, I take a shower. And I feel better. So I'm feeling a little better. So that's why I put on my makeup. So I could do this video. So anyways. um, So anyways, so it's Friday. Hold on. Sorry. Okay, our topic of this week is our New Year's resolution. Um, the, are we keeping up with our goals? What goals do we set up? What have we accomplished up to this time so far? Well, technically, the only goal that I actually promised myself is to keep away from the drama of my family. I have a lot of family members and there's a lot of drama going on. It always comes to something that... Someone gets involved. Someone say something, and some or someone heard something, and then uh, miss in miss um misunderstands it or say it. Oh, excuse me, or um you say your own word that it gets twisted, and the other people get involved. So that's a lot. I have a lot of family members. They all gossip. They all especially because most of us are girls from my dad's side they're most of us girls so we all gossip so most of the thing is i'm trying to stay away from my cousins i'm trying to stay away away from my family just to the point you know what i visit them once in a while i don't go like all the time like i used to because last year before on thanksgiving i got a big huge argument with my sister which to that led to me you know what i'm gonna start staying away i'm not gonna you know you know what's it called um, let other people, you know, um, run over me, so I just put a stop to it and everything, especially because I'm the oldest, I'm the older than her, so I was just like, you know what, so I technically, what happened, I stopped talking to her for all the way from Thanksgiving until New Year's, yeah, New Year's, until New Year's, so she actually apologized. Because I'm the type of person, if you're not going to apologize, I'm not going to talk to you. I'm not going to do that. So that's how I am. I'm sorry, but that's how I am. I'm like, uh, it, it goes to my heart, especially if it's not my fault. It's the other person's fault for saying what the, the person said. So that's what happened. That's, what my, uh, that's how I am. So I, I promised myself, and I, I told my husband about it too with his family. Because sometimes we have problems with his family. It happens to everybody, not just me. So... I tell my husband, you know what, we're going to stay away from all the drama, drama. we're going to stay, is our family is just me and you, because we're already legally married, so I'm like, you know what, my family is just me and you, we don't have to, like, <sighs> to ask other people for stuff, or certain things, you know, whatever, you know, if you need help, you know, I understand that, but to the point that you cannot always, um, depend on other people, you gotta depend on yourself and your significant other, that's it, or, you know, just, well, not significant other, but, like, like, so, you know what I mean, but just, you know, your fam little family, that's it, it's just them, that's your main priority, and that's it, and don't give, um, two cents about other people's, and that's it. 
So yeah, <clears throat> so that's pretty much it. The only thing that I'm keeping on, <clears throat> and the only thing that I actually did a huge promise, a huge thing for me to to keep on doing for the rest of the year, for the rest of my life, because that's how it's gonna be. And yeah, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just doing this short, simple, cause I don't wanna be a huge upload like most of my videos is they're being long. So yeah, so that's pretty much it. And yeah. So, um, if you have any of, any, um, any resolutions that you have accomplished or you are, like, on the process of accomplishing and so on, just leave them down below. I would love to hear them. Well, we love to hear them out and any, let's say you're almost about to fail or something and what are you doing to keep on track? Uh, like, let's say weight loss. I know I'm supposed to lose weight. <laughs> oh, I'm not supposed to. I try, I'm... I'm not supposed to lose weight. That's not, like, a big thing for me. Yeah, I'm fat, you know, whatever. But that was not, like, my resolution. My I would just, like, start eating healthier, which I am. I'm not eating fast food as much as, like, I used to. I don't drink soda. I don't drink a lot of sugars. I, I do. I might have a big ass sweet tooth. Uh, like, I could tell. This is, like, oh, <laughs> I got the Swedish fish thing. I love these. So yeah, that's the empty wrapper. That was from like last week, but I still have them just like to make sure I don't, to be like, okay, I already ate candy. I'm not going to eat it. I'm not going to eat no more, especially like nice home. Especially because my husband, I told my husband, you know what, make sure I don't eat junk food. Make sure I don't do this. I don't do that. Which is awesome because you have the other, your other significant, you know, to help you to, to keep you like, you know what, you're not, this is better for your health. You're not supposed to eat this. You're not supposed to eat that. Which is awesome because we're doing it both. And yeah, so that's pretty much it. So yeah, like, like, stuff like this, stuff, stuff like that. Like, what guys do you do? Like, do you, like, do you, um, like, put reminders on your wall, on your mirror or something? Like, like, something that's keep you motivated. What motivates you to keep um your resolutions and stuff like that? Just leave them down below. And I would like to read them. And that's pretty much it. Thanks everybody for watching. And stay fabulous. And be safe. And just be careful. And if you're sick, I hear you, sister. I hear you. I hear you. I'm dying. I'm supposed to wait for my husband to to go to the Otaka to want me to get um some Otaka medications. I already bought, I bought this from... What's it called? Walmart. When I finished it, that was like before the um, whole um before I got sick. not before I got sick like long time ago. The first time I got sick, like with the weather change, was like last year. That was from them. Not less like in the fall. That's what happened. Now that we're going to spring, I get sick again. So it's like two two times I get sick. So I finished that. So I'm gonna get something else. I don't know what I'm gonna get, but I'm gonna get something. So yeah, so that's pretty much it. Cause I'm already talking too much. All right, thanks everybody for watching. Bye.